Okay. So we got game one, oh, Smashville. Hold on a second. Uh, clear scores. Very good. Um, so, starting off uh, with some early dash attacks. Man, this has always bothered me so much. Right? Whoa. All right. So both uh, both Zelda and um, and Ike have down throws that are DI traps. Oh, and you have to DI them down and out, but they reverse you. And oh. In all of the sets that these two have played, I have never once seen them DI it correctly. It's like, no, it's your throw. Why don't you know how to DI it? Oh, my God. It drives me nuts. But, like, I think that uh, the first one, to, see there too, the first one to DI the throw correctly should just be awarded the game. You di you DI'd it up. What are you talking about? Ooh. Do you want to get God. hit with aerials? Todd popping off early. Honestly, I'm pretty excited to see Todd. Uh, last week, he had a very, very fun showing against Choice Scar. Uh, I wish I could have seen that stuff. Dude, it's on, it's on VODs. You can watch it. And what a bear. All right. Uh, Grizzly evening out the stocks, if not the percents. Uh, Todd playing it very safe right now with this neutral game. And there it is. Grizzly DI'd it correctly. Ladies and gentlemen, the set is over. We can all go home. Let's uh, all right. let's let's put this out, and it is two zero Grizzly at the moment. Let's not. All right, fine. Uh, let's see. I played Abu. I played uh, Danny Man. What? I have not played six matches. I'm waiting for a Code Man to get done so we can play on stream. But if you want me to move off, then I'll move off. Guys, sure likes commentating. True. Too much. Yo, know, can you blame him? What? Wait, what? Hmm? No, what did you say? I said, can you blame him for liking commentary? Uh, am I blaming him? You know what I mean. It's just like, can you blame the man for liking commentary? Oh. It's just so much fun. Oh well, as far as that's concerned, no, I can't blame you for liking it, but I can blame you for not. Doing playing your matches. matches, yeah. Like I'm already done my pool, and Mike hasn't even done half of my pool. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, so this is still game one. Haven't missed much. Do you know this is still game one? Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry, sure. sorry, I'm texting. It's just that I got this girl's number recently. Oh well, uh, maybe you should be texting her, not commentating. <laughs> I do both at the same time, dude. Oh, well, you're not. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying. It's hard to focus on the match and text somebody. When you have, like, and you're talking to me at the same time. So that's like that's major multitasking. I I guess. Uh, I, I'm sure trying to. Is. You're not typing while you're talking to me right now. Oh. Uh. <laughs> she can dunk you for that. You should at least tell her that you're on stream. Tell her that, then she can talk to you in the chat. Uh, I don't know if she has like a Hitbox account though. So. Oh well, uh, make her get one. All right. Uh, turns out how serious this girl is. Okay. All right. Todd evens it up. So so far, yeah, Grizzly so. has like a good percent lead, and Todd has a lot to come back for. Oh, all right. Okay. Good stuff to Grizz. Grizzly loves throwing out those bears and bears all the time. Uh, just one ban, yeah. So. No Yoshi's, only Bowser's Castle alternate today. And one ban. So we got rid of Yoshi's? Alright, stage. Yeah. Um, uh, for today. Alright. No one likes Yoshi's? Uh, I honestly have nothing to do with that statement. Like, I don't care about PM stages that much. So I don't know what people like and don't like. I mean, besides FD, which I know you don't really like. Uh, FD's just boring. That's about it. So I don't want to play on a boring stage. Fair enough. Grizzly is throwing out all the C-sticks. Um, 
but both both characters are gonna get earlier kills here, of course. Uh, we'll just see whether the the walls can make or can be made use of by Todd this time. Uh, he's not yeah, great right. on him, unfortunately. It just takes practice. Uh, up air doesn't kill yet. Surprising. I get a little bit heavy. A little bit heavy? A little bit. Ooh, that's uh, that side B. If you do it right, you can jump out of it. Uh, not sure if he was aiming for the, the instant one or not, but a little bit slow. Either way, it's a pretty cool idea. I like it. <laughs> uh, Todd evens it up now and uh, lets his Ike idle pose for a moment. I wonder what music this is. It's uh, this is Mike's song. Mike's song. Yeah, that's the name of the song on uh, WarioWare. Or interesting. For a second, I thought you were talking about Mike phones, and I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Like this isn't even his setup. How do you get that on this? Oh, nice use of Dens. Interrupted recovery. Yeah, he was doing that a bunch last game while you were texting. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, I mean, he covered the up beam multiple times in a row. That time the dins exploded. And another quarter back air, whatever so, that was. Grizzly has a stock lead right now. Let's see if Ta can even this up. Grizzly again landing with the back air. Kind of jumping around and back airing. Uh, main difference there would, would be... Uh, Airwave likes to nair on top of platform. Likes to land on them when there. Ooh, good read. Oh, good attempt at a read. I don't know about that. He uh, he gave up the stage. Grizzly rolled back behind him, punished him. I wouldn't say that's a good read at all. Well, I, I said I, I checked myself and said attempt at a read, but. Oh, no, like you have other moves that's gonna. Okay, so F smash, huge commitment. It's a good read if you know it's gonna work, like 100%. And you can't even get punished for it. Um, like, there's such a thing as a hard read that isn't a good read. Um, and, like, if you're going to mess up your attack, it might not be worth doing it. It really comes down to weighing your options together. Yeah. But yeah, rather than F-Smash, you can kill with other moves. Um, F-Tilt, safer, slower, or not as slow. Um, aerials. Much less landing lag. Uh, ooh, too slow on the back air. Could have killed right there. Like, you can cover all of the spaces F smash with forward air, and it's much less laggy because it has, it has landing frames that you L cancel. Seriously taking space with the dim fire. But kind of getting on the other side of it. All right. Uh, landed with another bear though. That's the kind of thing that Todd just has to play around. Um, like, oh, Zelda's in the air. I need to respect this space. Just like, oh, Ike is in the air. I need to respect the space that the sword takes up. Mm -hmm. uh, if, you're, if you're not giving that space to Zelda, she can just throw out those bears and bears free. Once again, we're getting rid of Green Hill here. Todd thinking about one of his favorite stages right now. Didn't really work out for him, but he's able to make the adjustments. Wait, Wario Win is one of Todd's favorite stages? He counter picks it often. Oh, okay. I, I don't know if that means it's his favorite or anything, but I usually try to pick it. I usually try to pick Green Hill Zone as often as possible whenever I'm playing. Is that because it's a favorite stage of yours or what? Yeah, it's just like a good luck stage for me. Like I, I whenever I play on there I usually have like good sets, happy sets. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's it's like a, a bit good of, it's idea. Like, yeah, it's a bit of a, like a personal thing. I know it's not optimal for my character, but probably not, it's probably not optimal for Game of Watch. But sometimes you don't have to worry about that. As long as you're comfortable, then you can yeah. play well. We're supposed to have fun here. Supposed to. I mean, sometimes people might take it a little bit too seriously, but it, it happens.
another dense fire this time. Just a little bit too slow. Oh, and Todd just getting bared again. Um, let's see. Oh, Todd jumps up there for the up air, which gives Zelda way back down. Um, can't really cover everything that Zelda can do when she lands. So you just have to be careful that you don't just give her the stage back. Inspire limits what Todd can do. So he has to jump over it. Uh, I don't like that roll from the edge. Uh, it just takes too long and you can't punish your opponent. I wonder if there's some kind of reaction option select you can do against Ice Recovery, where you stand on stage uh, until you see like face side B, um, and then during that time you're either grabbing the edge or you're punishing the side B. Oh, okay. Um, you can do that kind of stuff with some characters. Back here will kill and it's basically just covering it. options. Sword does not hit away the thin fire. Kind of disappointing that that happens. Yeah, well, that's what Grizzly's been taking advantage, uh, advantage of. Mm -hmm. Bad DI in that one. Uh, Grizzly loves just jumping out of there with fair. Todd not ready for the tech chase. Uh, a little bit too high to combo. I wonder if he could have done something with other aerial and sent him to the side. Uh, I usually see air wave in air, for instance. Todd off stage again, but uh, that's not going to work that oh. way. Here's the showing is too much. Bad cancel. Another air. This time oh. the Dinsfire saves him. <laughs> Todd does not want to risk getting hit by that F smash. Could be as big as like. <laughs> Grizzly does not jump into the forward smash. Unfortunate for Ike. <laughs> Ooh, that was really good. That's pretty neat. So all three games go to Grizzly. Yeah, another to three O today. Many of those. How many matches do you have left? Three matches? That's half the pool. What? I do not know what we're going to have next. Pools means everybody else is still playing right now. Um, I think Mike said he was waiting to play Codeman on stream, right? Uh, yeah. Well, he's playing Chris oh. 